Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Frictions back here for another video on GTA 5 Online. And obviously today is Thursday, so you know the weekly update has rolled around and we got a new vehicle in the game, but it's not any kind of vehicle. Um this vehicle is one that can hold vehicles, I'm pretty sure, and you can use it as like a ramp and stuff like that, so we are gonna be buying it. I don't know exactly what it's called, but I know it's a vapid vehicle. I'm gonna see right now exactly what it is. I'm pretty sure it's under San Andres uh, Super Autos. It is a vapid slam truck, and it is 1.3 mil. So that is quite a lot. Go ahead and buy it. Put it in the same garage that I'm in right here with all these new DLC vehicles right here. So yeah, 1.3 mil is quite a lot for this vehicle. Customize it. We're gonna, you know, use it. Um, I have a couple friends in lobby, so we're probably gonna mess around with this vehicle. All right, so the Vapid Slam Truck is here. And uh, yeah, it looks kind of weird, you know, but it's a utility vehicle. I wonder about the amount of creative ideas that people are going to be coming up with trying to use this vehicle and god damn it kind of drifted right there. And it's actually not that slow for this kind of vehicle it's not that slow. Yo this thing drifts guys what the fuck. <laughs> okay okay so it has an interesting engine sound. As you guys can hear. Not too bad obviously the speed isn't the best I mean you shouldn't expect much from this vehicle. But it is 1.3 mil, so I don't know exactly if this is worth it. I think it's going to be worth it a lot for people who do car meets. And, you know, for people who just want to, you know, collect every vehicle in GTA in general. It's probably worth it already. But for average Joe, like I am in GTA, why would I buy this vehicle? Well, we're going to customize it and we're going to see why or why I shouldn't buy this vehicle or have bought it. Alright guys, so this is my fully customized Vapid Slam Truck, and I'm gonna be honest, this thing is one ugly ass vehicle, but it is pretty dope though, for, you know, probably what you can do with it, for the most part. Really interesting vehicle to add into the game, and the handling is dog shit, but in turn it does really drift a lot. See, they didn't know how to customize this kind of vehicle, hold on, when you back up it just beeps. I forget that this is a utility vehicle and not a muscle collar of any kind, bro. <laughs> yeah, interesting vehicle, is this worth 1.3 mil? Nah, this this isn't worth it. I feel like I just wasted my money on a vehicle I'm probably never gonna touch again. This is once again useful for, you know, creative ideas or maybe car meets and, you know, maybe messing around. But I really don't see this vehicle having much of a use. Maybe I'm wrong. You know, maybe you guys can tell me in the comments below, you know, other uses for this vehicle. Apart from just wanting to own it just because. There's not much I can really say about this vehicle. I really don't like it too much. I really don't think it's worth 1.3 mil. Don't waste the 1.3 mil, guys. Unless you want to drift a shit ton. Well, I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. Obviously, I'm coming at you guys with more GTA 5 videos and just content in general. Continue uploading. If you guys want to support this channel, obviously drop a like, subscribe. And go follow all my socials down in the description below in the link tree. And other than that, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.